out here today looking at a cool little weapon. It's the Remington TAC-13. Uh, similar in design to the pumps on the market, the uh, Mossberg Shockwave and the Remington TAC-14. This is semi-automatic. It's based on the uh, VX-3 design. It's got the uh, ports in the chamber, the gas ports in the chamber, so it allows you to have a shorter shotgun instead of that gas port way down here on the barrel. It functions great if the uh, length of the shell limits the amount of gas that enters the system to cycle of action. So it'll work with things from light one ounce loads all the way up to three inch magnum heavy loads. Uh, buckshot, slug, birdshot, whatever you want to shoot in it, this going to handle it. The gas operated semi-automatic action makes it uh, recoil feels lighter than on any of the pumps on the market. It's smoother. It just works really well. Hadn't had any problems with it. Function 100% so far. We're going to shoot it a little bit, show you how it does. I think MSRP on this thing is about $915, but you can probably find it for less. They are on the market now. Uh, just an uh, excellent design. It's got a uh, trigger pull. It's nice and crisp. It comes in at about four pounds. Only thing I don't like on it, being left-handed, I don't like the cross bolt safety. But that's on here. A lot of people like the cross bolt safety. Works well if you know how to use it and get used to it. But it's a nice design. It's drilled on top. If you want to put an optic on it, you can put a rail on it. Mount an optic on here. It's a, a magazine holds five plus one in the chamber gives you a total of six. Either two and three quarter or three inch magnum shot shells. It's not classified as a shotgun. It's a it's a firearm. Uh, so you can fill out just a standard 4473 for the NFA. Uh, National Firearms Act, you don't have to do any of that. You can buy it just like buying any other gun with a Form 4473, fill out your paperwork, get your background check, take it home with you. It's a good uh, uh, gun. Check it out at uh, Remington.com. I'm going to shoot two different loads here. One is a number four buck, which I really like. That's a good uh, good all around load. Also a double alt buck. Show you how they pattern here at seven yards. A lot of people think that any kind of shot shell is going to spread and take out everything within a zip code. That's not true. You know, inside the confines of a house or whatever, uh, about seven yards is about how far you're going to be shooting on a good bedroom, living room, whatever. You can show you can cover these groups by hand. That's the number four buck right there. That's the double alt buck right there, nine pellet load, all contained right there. He's gone. That'll take him out. I'll also do a little, uh, show you how bird shot patterns at this same distance. It shows how a load of bird shot patterns the same distance. That was a piece of the wad went through right there. Still cover it with my hand. It's a load of bird shot at uh, 21 feet, 7 yards. Uh, to order this firearm online, you can go to galleryofguns.com, click on the Gun Genie, and you'll get uh, prices from different dealers in your area where you'll go pick up the firearm. They'll ship it to them. You'll go pick it up, uh, do your transfers, all that kind of thing. Perfectly legal to buy it online from galleryofguns.com. This weapon also has a magazine cutoff. If you've got a buckshot in the mag tube and you want to change the slug, something like that, it's easy to change without cycling all the way through. Push forward on the magazine cutoff. That'll block anything coming out of the magazine. Open your chamber, drop in the other shell, push your magazine cutoff, and you're ready to go. Very smooth. I'm gonna give our old Crow Magnum buddy here a load of uh, double alt buckshot at seven yards. 